There's literally just platies like everywhere in here. That is incredible. Got a bin? You're 6 1. Two Indian spotted turtles. What is going on, Kfiros? Welcome back to another video here. Today, my house is an absolute mess, but for a very good reason. We got new paint, we got new bathrooms going in, we got new, like new everything. Just check it out. It's a new house. It's actually a new house. Look at the walls. It's like this, it's, it's like a gray, but if you look at it from a certain angle, it's a blue. So much better. And it just fills in the whole house. Now check this out. Look at the tank. Remember I told you once we painted the walls around it, it was gonna pop the frame of white out much more? Check this out. Dude, look at that. You can see all the little things inside the water right now. It's from cleaning the glass. I just cleaned the glass and did a water change in there. Right, buddies? They're like, yep. It is insane, look at that. Before I show you the bathrooms too, look what happened outside. Look what's going on outside. They already, although it's a mess, forgive the mess, but look at this. The fence is gone. Remember I told you last video we're gonna take that, that black fence out, this fence right here? It's gone. It looks so good. Now we can put the furniture out. It looks so good. Uh, piece of the fence got in the pool. But look how clear the pool is. Things are just coming along. Things are really just coming along here. Finally, finally things are just being put together like a puzzle. I saw some comments on last video and you'll know exactly what I'm talking about if you have seen the last video. Some were saying like stop buying animals if you don't have time for the animals that you're buying. It was nowhere near that. Clearly on social media it's a lot harder to explain things. What I was saying was a puppy, a dog, is a lot different than a turtle or a fish. They're completely different things. Yes, both need care, but completely different care. A dog wants you to be around it almost 24 seven. You gotta take it out to the bathroom, especially as the puppy stages, nearly almost every hour or it's just gonna make in your house a ton. Fish, go in the tank. That's what water changes are for. A turtle, goes in the pond. That's what water changes are for. My point is, the dog is much different than a fish or a turtle. A dog requires like a relationship, a legitimate relationship. My brother can come and easily feed fish, turtles once a day. The dog needs someone there 24 seven, if not 24 seven, a lot of the time during the day. Right now, in the moment of time in my life, I am not here enough to have a puppy. I bought the puppy not expecting it, and I gave it to my friend that lives five minutes from me with two kids and another German Shepherd. There's not much of a better place it could have been. I'm gonna see Zoe so much, it's incredible. Hopefully you guys understand that. It makes more sense than I that explain it right now, seeing your guys' comments. I just thought of that and then I had to say it, but. Now let's get back to the video. The yard is looking insane because we got 35 loads of fill coming in. I think we're at like 17 so far, 17 loads, 18, 19, 20 now. How the fish doing? Fish doing good. What's up everyone, how you doing? When I tell you I am literally transforming this house, I'm literally transforming it. When I first moved in here, here's some of the pictures of what the house looked like. I mean, it was nowhere near what it is right now. And that's one of the best parts about a house. Not only is it an insane investment, but it's such a cool project to have. Always on your hands. You're always like, okay, I gotta do this, I gotta do that. And I love having a nice challenge on my hands. What's up, girl? You're up basking? She's like, yeah, I'm chilling. Anyway, let's head back inside and I wanna show you what the bathrooms look like. Here we go, walking in. So the cabinets, everything's out right now, even the toilet. Um, but look at the shower. That is incredible. It looked not, oh God. It's like this granite look. So dope, I think it is granite actually. Granite tile. New tiles going in, obviously the toilet, countertop, new countertop and everything. And you wanna know something cool, and the reason why I film this stuff going on at my house is because when I wasn't a YouTuber, didn't make YouTube videos, I used to watch other YouTubers and they would have stuff being done to their house and they would film it, and I myself would love to see the progress go on video by video. So that's why I film it, because everyone that's watching right now, if you don't enjoy it, I seriously do apologize you have to watch it, but other than that, for those of you who do care, and I see a lot of people that love seeing the progress done to the house, that's why I film it, that is exactly why. Because you see step by step from when I moved in all the way to when it's completely done. Although the backyard's three acres and we're just working on one side so far. And before I set something up for these guys, make something really cool for them, similar to what Blake has for his, I got the idea from him, Blake's Exact Animal Ranch. I gotta show you where I got them. Where did I get them? I'll show you right now, here we go. 
two Indian spotted turtles. From India. These things are absolutely beautiful, by the way. Perfect lighting, too. Thank you, thank you. Yes, no problem. Look at that. Look at them. Would you just look at that? Just look at that. Look wow. Look at the bellies. They are actually very, very cool looking. Like, that is an incredible looking turtle. Mm -hmm. Now you have two of them to the yes. side. For who? For you, Paul Cafaro. Wow, th thank you, man. No problem, brother. I appreciate that. These are really, really cool, and I cannot wait to make them something super cool. For now, I know where I'm going to put them. Obviously, in something similar to this, but a little bit bigger. Just like I have my Albino Ready or Sliders Amazing. outside. What do you think? Kayla, what do you think it's of this? So <laughs> oh, no, no. What is that? It's a pied pectinata. It's a panda. Oh, that, I've seen those before. Dude, those are so dope. Wow, that thing's friendly. Right? He's really dirty right now. When he freshly sheds, it's like pearl white. Yeah, but you can see why the name is Panda. Yup. I mean, look at that. <laughs> Got a bin? <laughs> yeah. I learned the same exact thing from Blake's Exotic Animal Ranch. I think I mentioned that already, but this is where I got the idea. You need one of these tubs, super cheap. You can get them at Lowe's, Home Depot, pretty much anywhere. This right here is perfect. They can't crawl out of it. It's got the curved edges, and we're gonna put that just like that. This is obviously not where it's gonna go. It's just gonna stay in the screened in patio for now. Then you wanna get the bricks just like that. Put them like that, right? Two stones and a bin. Okay, we're going to fill the water up to about right there, probably about right there, which will then allow them to crawl up here, get onto here, and of course, this is the better side. They'll easily be able to climb up that, especially once the water's like right here. Now, I'm probably going to end up putting these turtles like right here because certain parts of the day, the light comes in and that's when they can get their natural light. Without further ado, I need to get a bucket of water, which is very easy when you have water everywhere in your house. But literally, now, hopefully it makes more sense to you because if you look closely, see how the water level is like right up to that rock? They can easily climb up there. This water is perfect temperature too. It's clear one day, and then it's green the next day, and then it's clear again, and then it's green, and then it's clear, 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 and then it's green. So it has like bipolar stages. Anyway, before I get the turtles in here, I want to show you guys what we got. Check this big thing out. Hey, Joey, what do you think of the truck? Huge. It's a monster truck. Yeah. Check this thing out. Joey, stand next to it for us. <laughs> I'm 6'1. You're 6'1. Look how big that truck is. My boy, Paul Thigpin, up there. At Paul Thigpin on Instagram. You can check him out. I also have his stuff in the description down below. Hooked it up with this massive Chevy 2019 Duramax. As you know, I had a Tacoma for a really long time. And uh, I actually ended up just giving that to my parents and bumping up a stage. This thing is so badass. It is a monster truck. I mean, when you're when you're talking about like height, this thing is very high. The best part is it's got a much bigger bed than the Tacoma did, and it also could pull anything I wanted to pull. Like actually, Joey, actually could pull anything. Yeah. We got the Instas on the back at Paul Cafaro at Paul Thigpen. Once again, big shout out to Paul Thigpen. None of this is obviously possible without him. Let me show you. It's 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 a beautiful, beautiful truck. Hopefully it's unlocked. Yes, it is. Hey Joey, can you help me up? I need help. I got you. Just push me yeah, from yeah, the back. I got you. Thanks. Appreciate yeah. it. It's very nice in here. It's got uh, this black leather. Is this leather? Yeah. It's huge on the inside. Like we can go on a solid road trip. I mean, I had to go to Georgia to pick it up. Shout out to dad because he drove a lot of the way. So far the name is Betsy, but there's no permanent name just yet. So if you have any cool truck names, drop them in the comments down below. She's pretty big. And for those of you who were wondering about the car too, I still do have the other car. It's just at my parents' house. This patio bowl has taken off. There's, I believe it's like 11, 13, oh, you're taking a nice, you know what? There's literally just platies like everywhere in here. They're breeding like crazy. Look at this four right there, five. There's one down there too coming up. 
these roots just grew down and it creates such a natural environment for these fish, it's insane. It was the smallest little plant about like this big and now just look at it, growing up the wall. Crazy. It's, it's actually insane how pretty these turtles are. Spots just absolutely everywhere. An Indian spotted turtle. Gotta be probably one of my favorite species of turtle that I've ever had. Well, let's bring him over there and uh, get him in their pond. Our two Indian spotted turtles are about to go into their new, obviously, temporary home until they grow. They're gonna go out with the other turtles. But for now, since they're just little babies, they're gonna be in a screened-in patio, and they're gonna go right into here. Watch, ready? Watch them take off. So long, buddy. And now let me get your big brother. I don't know if these are males or females. They're a little young to see just yet. I guess we'll figure that out as they grow. But these are just beautiful, beautiful. Look at the spots, look at the design. That is an unbelievable looking turtle. Go buddy. Ready? Boop. Oh, there's the air bubbles. And now, they're good to go. If they wanna get out of the water, they'll climb up there. I'm gonna feed them just pretty much like what I fed every other little turtle when I had it. Just like turtle pellets. May give them a little snack every once in a while, like maybe some fresh fish. But for now, spotted Indian, the Indian spotted turtle. Check it out. Beautiful, beautiful species. Oh, <laughs> we got Mac here. We are filming a dope Instagram video. So go to my Instagram, Apple Hulkafer. It's down in the description down below. You gotta check it out. Why is Zach dressed as a ref? We don't know. Whistle, please. Holy moly. Sorry, headphone users, it's my fault. That is. Unsubscribe from no. Catcher Moss. Okay. No, no, no. <laughs> say, say to him. Subscribe to the channel if you have not done so already. It's down below for free. Just hit it, and of course, click the bell if you haven't done so already. I got today's positive comment right here. Hey, Zach, you want to read it? Yeah, please. Paul, you are the best. Keep it up, and I will always, always watch your videos. There we go. If you want to have wait, your wait, comment. Wait. Sorry. Vidos. You're the best. Fine. <laughs> if you want to win a positive comment, shout out and have your comment on the screen when I was up coming videos, all you gotta do is drop a positive comment down in the comments down below, and that is that. Thank you all for watching. Until next time, I'll see you in the next video. Get them all!